So according to an up and coming model slash photographer, she had a business arrangement with Kayla Nicole TV. Now the reason why the model was exposing Kayla because obviously the business arrangement didn't go as planned. Now according to the model, she said that Kayla Nicole posted on her Instagram that she needed an LA photographer to take pictures of her cover for her edible song. Real quick, word of advice for up and coming makeup artists, hairstylists, whatever it is that you do, make sure you go old fashioned. Get a paper contract. Don't try to do business in DMs. It don't work out. You can start the business, but let that not be your ending because DMs can be leaked messages, you can add messages, you can Photoshop stuff. So to avoid all of that, get a paper contract with somebody so that way you can take them to court and get whatever it is that's owed to you. Because this is the second time that I had to tell a story in regards to a photographer that didn't get compensated for his work. The last person that Kayla worked with, he said that he didn't get compensated for his work. He was supposed to get tagged, he was supposed to get paid, and he was an actual photographer for Kayla, not Ty. So when you go trying to go behind me getting stories, and try to discredit my work, make sure you get the right information because he never was hired by Ty, he was hired by Kayla. But that's what I was saying, I'm sorry. Now let's fast forward to the day before the photo shoot because everything was planned and agreed upon between Kayla and the photographer. Now Kayla DM'd her and said that she wanted to switch everything around as far as props, the scenes, and everything that was already planned and already put together, which the photographer didn't have a problem with. But keep in mind that the photographer is not getting paid. I just wanna emphasize that. Not only did Kayla wanna switch everything around, but she also did not not have a makeup artist, which the photographer had to reach out to a makeup artist. An agreement was put in place as far as the makeup artist would not get paid, neither she would only receive attention. I don't know why attention is greater than money, but okay. Now, as far as a hairstylist, Kayla said that she would bring her own wig and the photographer agreed that she would put her wig on. And if she wanted to switch up to other looks, she also had some other wigs for her as well. Now that was the day before the photo shoot. Now the day of the photo shoot, Kayla hit up the photographer and said, oh, I'm running late and I forgot my wig. So now the photographer had to provide her with hair because she completely did not bring her wig at all. Now when Kayla and the manager finally got to the photo shoot, Kayla was getting her hair done by the photographer and she was also getting her makeup done. Halfway through getting makeup and hair done, the manager says, oh, well, we have to go to a meeting. Can we postpone this whole photo shoot? Maybe do it for a later time. And the photographer agreed that she would do the photo shoot for a later time. Um, almost was about to come from the photo shoot, but we didn't have time to take pictures because this stupid told me about an 11 o'clock meeting last night and I was scared to say something because I still wanted to take a fucking picture. Kayla ended up leaving, going to a meeting and later on that day, Kayla came back. So when Kayla, Nicole and the manager ended up coming back to the photo shoot, they were rushing the photographer because according to Kayla, she had to go out with the same people she had a meeting with earlier that day. So she was rushing the photographer. So the photographer realized she only had a short amount of time to take certain pictures. Now fast forward to after the photo shoot when the photographer had to edit these pictures. Now she sent her the rough draft of how the pictures look so that way she can say, oh I want to change this I want to do this which the photographer said that Kayla did that 20 times she ended up switching something sending it switching it sending it switching it sending it and she didn't have a problem she remained nice and professional to Kayla she switched what she wanted to switch but during her editing process Kayla let her know listen you only have a short amount of time because I want to get these pictures up as soon as possible my song is dropping tomorrow night so now the editor is rushing and working overtime trying to complete these pictures and do the edits that she wanted her to do and eventually the pictures did go up but when the pictures finally did go up the photographer and the makeup artist was not mentioned do not rely on dms and word of mouth people can switch up at any given time make sure whatever you're supposed to get put it in a contract the crazy part about it is it's not like these girls are asking for money people ask for five thousand six thousand if you go to la and get a real photographer they're charging you a arm and a leg for pictures so the fact that this girl did everything provided everything was willing to do everything provided you with a makeup hair and a set to take pictures the least you could have did was tag her it's not like you had to break the bank to pay her now if you didn't like the work or felt some type of way about the pictures then you could have had a conversation with her she could have changed some things around or you could have just gave her a little donation and said thank you but no thank you and she would have took that money and you could have still put the pictures up and not tag her in the picture that would have been a whole lot better than straight ignoring her because at least she got something out of the deal she got some kind of donation for her work even though kayla nicole didn't want to shout her out because she maybe didn't like the pictures which i felt that's probably what the problem was and being that it's the last minute is she can't switch things around as quickly as she want to you know she had to end up using these pictures but if that was the case then you should have let her know that and then gave her a small donation for her time but to straight not do what y'all agreed that was tacky that's my opinion but y'all leave your comments down below let me know what you're thinking until next time peace